I have my most important exams till now in my life, inshallah, right after Eid. I need to prepare for it during Ramadan. And I'm worried that I may uh, lose uh, the strength for preparation. Uh, what is the ruling for me? There is no problem, Akhi. As long as you are not interested in paradise and have no problem in going to hell, you have no problem. You can skip fasting. The most important exam in my life. What is your life? The most important exam in your life is what you're living at the moment, which the results would know, be known after your death, whether you go to paradise or go to, he to hell. Exam. And you're afraid of losing concentration. What are you going to do? Applying for NASA? Are you applying, uh, making a, a, an atomic bomb? <laughs> what exams are you talking about? Get a life, my friend. This is not how Muslims act and react to tests of Allah Azza wa Jal. Allah has created that in, in this life to be tested. No exam on earth would justify that you break your fast. And it's not the exam that is making you break your fast. It's a preparation. So even if what you find a sheikh, uh, these uh, drive-through sheikhs, who would say, okay, you can, yeah, yeah, this is a necessity. It's your job. It's your career. It's okay. You can break your fast. So the second step for shaitan is uh, waking up for Fajr is problematic. You know, Fajr is three o'clock in Kuwait maybe or whatever. No, so can I skip that so that I can get my energy? You'll find another sheikh would say, okay. And then said, wallahi, the five prayers altogether, the concept itself, it's difficult, man. It's, it's, it's burdensome. What is left of your religion, O Muslim? The answer is no. This is totally not permissible. And it is totally an indication of your lack of Iman. Where does your intellect come from? Where does success come from? It comes from Allah. It's like, with all due respect, Danny, excuse my French, a prostitute coming and saying, Wallahi, Sheikh, it's difficult to fast during the daytime of Ramadan. You know, business is, uh, uh, is tough these days and we have to always be ready. A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitan Are you a Muslim? What is this? Rizq comes from Allah. If a thief, a burglar, someone who sells drugs, he says, I have to make a living. Then you don't know who Allah is. And you made your choice between hell and heaven. So, Akhi, I apologize for being a little bit coming rude or a little bit um, strong, but this is a wake-up call. No exam on earth justifies not obeying Allah, not fulfilling, fulfilling the pillars of Islam at all. And Allah knows best.